the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello. Gamer Nome is back. We are done with the Glam Eyes. We've punched Overlord to death. And now I'm gonna defeat Akaza and unlock all his powers. Yes, all his powers, all Akaza, Azeka or Akaza Blood Demon Art. Using and defeating him with just one skill. Oh wait, now that I realized it, I used two skills. <laughs> Explosive Nova and this red thing. Did you see that guys? The one that exploded? That one. So I'm gonna use only two skills. Again, no blink, no, uh, what do you call this? One for all, 100%. Guys, just these two skills. If you don't have the Explosive Nova, that's fine. Explosive Nova only increases the damage. So if you cannot do that, then if you don't have that, then it's fine. Again, it's fine. Okay, so as you can see, I'm just running around, right? Running around and using the Z skill. Because guys, the one thing that I noticed with Akaza is he will keep chasing you, whatever happens. Just like a mask villain, right? And Broly. And also, whenever Akaza attacks, he lunges forward. So I thought that, oh, every time he lunges forward, I will make a sidestep. See that, guys? Sidestep and use the Z skill. Oh, by the way, for those who want to know what skill is this, this is the first skill of Limitless, okay? Limitless, the cursed technique of Gojo Satoru, right? And the proof is under my character. Cursed technique is active. So you can defeat this boss under 3 minutes, 2 minutes, 20 or 30 seconds, something like that. Okay, guys, again, I'm just using two skills here. One skill as a damage skill. And that's it. Game yeah, I'm gonna use other skills, yes. But be wary that if that skill will make you slower, then it's a no-no. So I can suggest that you use skills such as uh, the Inferno boss drops or the ice spikes, which is very hard to achieve because you need to get that skill from uh, what do you call this? Renegade. Yeah, something Renegade. The, the Christmas boss. Okay. Okay. Here we go, 2 minutes and he's almost dead. Guys, when he transforms, like uh, activates his C skill, right? We will be getting that skill. The one that makes him stronger and faster. Do you see that? Your Z skill's damage will get stronger because he will get faster and he will catch all the damage. So everything will be faster. And by the way, don't forget to use Mark on the Phoenix for healing, etc. And if you have the Phoenix Fruit, you can change and heal. Don't use the support armament because you will stop from moving, okay? So with that technique, we were able to unlock three skills. Akaza Blood Demon Art, that's it. And also this one, Compressed Needle. And the last one is the Annihilation Type, okay? So is there another technique, Gamer Gnome? Yes. Ice Armament? Yes, but I won't be showing you that. This one, you can, because you can unlock this now. Check it out, guys. This is the one for all, right? 100%. And so just use it and use lots of skills and you will be stuck in the air. See that, guys? Again, boom. Exit skill. Okay. Make sure to spam. Spam skills. And just like with the other bosses, you will stay in the air. But here, I will be using lots of skills. See that guys? I'm in the air and Akaza is like, where is he? Where is he? <laughs> okay. So let's speed it up a little bit. Actually, let's speed it up because I will just be attacking, attacking, and attacking Akaza until we defeat him. Okay, so after this, we will be doing a showcase. I'm gonna show you if it is, is it worth it to unlock all Akaza's skills? Well, we're about to find out. Boom, there you go. Okay. Okay, so now let's try all the skills. Again, is it worth it, Gamer Gnome? Here you go. You're gonna find out. So again, Akaza, you need to unlock all the skills. When it says a boss drop, Akaza Blood Demon Art, doesn't mean that you've unlocked three. You need to fight, fight, fight until you unlock the two remaining. So 
I was able to unlock first is the air type and then the compass needle and the annihilation type, right? Okay, so let's try it. First, you need to activate it. There you go. Let's try the Z skill. Ooh, what? Let's increase the graphics. Oh, it's already on max. Hmm. Okay. Oh, so that's it. <laughs> For the damage, 10 DE, right? 10 DE and everything it touches will be damaged. Okay. Okay, so let's try the second skill now. The second skill is the Annihilation type. First one is the Air type, right? Next one is the Annihilation type. So you will launch forward, okay? Launch forward. Oh, there you go. Okay. Okay, not bad. Again. One more time. There you go. Okay. Higher damage, 60. 60 damage. 60 DE. So why am I showing you the damage? Because the last skill, the Compass Needle, creates a snowflake that will increase all your damage. Your air type and your annihilation type. So let's check it out. Boom. Oh, it really looks cool, guys. Wow. Oh, see that? Times to damage. The 10 DE became 20 DE damage. So it's a combo, right? It's a combo. So the 60 DE became 120 DE. So is it worth it? Let's try it in the boss. Kurama boss. But one more thing, you cannot use your compass needle with this explosive nova. See that? Explosive nova is active. Is there a glitch? I haven't tried it yet. So here you go, Kurama. You're using Marco the Phoenix. Okay, champion. Okay, the damage is... Okay, 60. Okay, that's kind of lame. <laughs> to be honest. 60, okay? Again, one more time. Boom, okay. It became... Yeah. 60 almost 60 so next we're gonna try the annihilation type and after that we will include the compass needle to increase the damage the damage of annihilation type is 90 mm, 90 so we will expect 180 damage right okay so here we go activating compass needle it really looks cool okay okay so now first stop 688 so we will expect a 560 something HP yep it's working guys it's working this air type with the with the needle so let's try the annihilation now sky type with the needle <laughs> what the damage is still 90 with the annihilation type so let's try it again Boom. we're gonna use the annihilation type we're expecting a 180 damage we have 478 okay let's go Okay, so the damage is still 90. Hmm. Is it bugged? Again, again, again. 388. Let's wait for it to cool down. Ah, 298, sorry. I missed it. Okay. Boom. Okay, 90 damage. Even if the compass needle is activated, again, I think this is bugged. So that's it for the skills. Let's just defeat it with the air type. Okay. So again, I hope that you unlock all the powers of Akaza if you think it's worth it. But that's it. I hope that this guide was able to help you again. To all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. This is GamerNom. And GamerNom out.